guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another home gym video. In today's video, guys, I wanted to talk about some uh, accessories for your home gym and what I think the best or most important thing to have is. So this is not in terms of gym equipment. Uh, I'm talking accessories like, um, you know, wall storage, um, look around flags, <clears throat> uh, places to put stuff, and stuff like this, the TV behind me. So what I think is most important to have for a home gym is actually a little TV setup, just like this. So the thing with TVs now, is you can get a, you know, you can get a decently sized smart TV for anywhere from, for under 500 bucks, you know, depending on how big you want it. Um, and they're really all, you know, they're all the same. Like they're all HD, they're all, um, they have like the built-in apps on them. So like uh, me, for example, I don't have satellite or anything at my house, but uh, you know, I could get all the YouTube, Netflix, whatever. So, and that's all built in. So it doesn't need any special, you know, cable hookups or anything like that. You just plug it in and, and away you go. So <clears throat> the reason I like having one in the gym so much, and I was a bit back and forth on whether I was gonna do it at first, um, because I have, uh, I, I've got like a nice little stereo that I can use for music and stuff. And I was thinking like, you know, it, it takes up a little bit of space. What am I really gonna need a TV down here for? Um, <clears throat> but it's nice just to be able to throw on a video or whatever, like when you're warming up. Um, if you're riding the bike, it's nice to have something to zone out and watch uh, too. And yeah, it just makes, it, it kind of goes back to something we talked about a few videos ago. It, it just kind of makes the space, um, <clears throat> More of a space that you want to be in, which I think is very important for uh, for a home gym. Like if you really, um, you know, not regret, not to, like if you don't look forward to coming down into your your workout area, it probably means your workouts gonna be cut short. You know, you're not gonna be as into them. Um, but if it's a space that you really like and that you want to be in, um, <clears throat> I, I think a TV helps with that. And I feel like that kind of just fuels everything else. It fuels your workouts, it fuels your motivation, which are very important things when um, you know you're working out by yourself, 99% of the time. And yeah, yeah. Also, uh, what I would say, <clears throat> the next biggest thing. It, it was kind of tough to pick which one, but I wanted to go. The reason I said the TV was the best was because it was also the cheapest and it's the easiest for anyone to just kind of throw in, like anywhere in their house if they're in a garage or a basement or. Um, you know anything like that <clears throat> but another thing is having mirrors now I went a little bit overboard with mine this is like a it's like a mirror wall um, so these are four by six foot uh, sheets and I, I think mirrors are very important I think I did go a little bit overkill on it though because I feel like the only time you really want one for me anyways is when I'm squatting that's the only time I really like to use it obviously it's nice you know you get the curls in and look and see but um, yeah I think that uh, you don't need a setup like this this was like um, I think it was like 600 bucks because I had them um, they weren't like custom design they sell them um, at that height but <clears throat> they were very big sheets so it, yeah it was like 550 to get them shipped and then to get them installed and, and put them up on the on the stone wall that was a that was a nightmare um, just bring them into the gym, I remember, because I brought them into, I'll show you guys this, I brought them into, down through this door, and it's like a, it's like a, I don't know, like a storm cellar, like trap door, right? So there's literally like four feet of clearance um, from the, from the slab to the, <coughs> to the top of the door, and the, the mirror's four feet wide, right? So I had to, I somehow got it in without breaking it. I did chip it eventually, but um, I had to like awkwardly carry the mirror like this and it's like taking the whole floor space and I kicked the door open and I was just like this is not gonna go well I'm gonna smash this mirror for sure but somehow we ended up getting it in um, so yeah mirrors TV wall storage um, I think that's kind of you know goes without saying you're gonna need some sort of way to organize all your extra stuff your bands your chains your belts your sleeves um, I like to just get them up off the floor that's my idea um, you know especially with all the crawlers I found around here recently uh, I used to have everything just kind of lumped into the floor in a, in a little circle of all the stuff I used and that you know was kind of annoying to always have to sort through so some sort of storage to get stuff up off the floor looking nice again makes the space a nice space that you want to be in and it's just easier to uh, to access everything and none of that stuff is expensive so it, it, it just makes sense to do but uh, yeah guys get 
a TV for your home gym. It is a game changer for sure. So hope that helps you guys out. Hope that some of you are interested in it. As always, thank you so much for watching. That is going to wrap it up for the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you find it interesting or entertaining or informative. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content. And we'll see you in the next one, guys. Check it out. Back, back, back.